Project update, September the 29th. This piece I have stolen out of the car in the field that I showed you in a previous video. Down here I have fabricated this piece, kind of had to curve it. I don't know if you can see that or not, but I had to curve that piece. Uh, and uh, so anyways, fixed to pull it all out, sandblast it, prime it, weld it. I'll show you what uh, the finished product looks like. Okay, so I am done making this repair down here. You can see that I have grafted the new piece in, uh, welded uh, everything, ground it down and whatnot. So it's, it's all done there. Um, I wanted to share an epiphany that I had uh, working on this section here. So I had to make a repair in here where it was rotted, make a repair in here where it was rotted, rebuild all of this. And not just that, I had to cut this section out that goes right here so that I could gain access to the inside and fix that. So this is one of those cases where I should have evaluated things better on the front end and realized what had to be done on the inside, you know, and, and just done a better job on the front end of realizing that, frankly, this entire panel, you know, was not worthy of trying to fix tit for tat here, there, here, there, you know, till everything was finally done. This whole panel was like $65, $70, and so in retrospect, I should have just cut the whole thing out, uh, you know, welded a whole new one in. It would have been way, way faster. Totally worth the $65, $70, but frankly, I just did a poor job of knowing what lied ahead because I didn't evaluate things on the front end as well as I should. Um, so... <laughs> That's my epiphany, you know, if you're doing a job like this, uh, sandblast everything down, have a look at the inside before you make your decision about what you're going to do. I made the wrong decision, uh, and I granted I went ahead and decided to finish with the route that I'm going here because after you're halfway through, at that point, it's like, uh, I might as well finish versus trying to cut everything out you've already done and weld a new piece in. At some point, you're far enough through the damn process that you might as well just continue forward, so... Uh, that's what I learned. Hope you guys can learn from my mistakes because that was a pretty solid one. A bunch of time spent. Um, if you want to see more of my Redline Update videos, hit the subscribe button. And uh, if you're enjoying this, give it two thumbs up. Thanks for watching, guys. Y'all have a good weekend.